hello everyone hope you people received round 2 mail you can check the mail okay for the round 2 or you can check the super set id you can go for super set account or you can check your email those who attempted congruent communication round everybody received round 2 mail if you not attempted i think it's a doubt uh, otherwise everybody received it seems you wait for uh, late night you keep checking your mails and super set account both right a uh, super set account under that assessments or events in super set account you go for assessments or events likewise there you can uh, see okay any links are available or not right fine so those who received mail you can find like this a dear candidate greetings from congregant like that now first thing what you have to do from this email id okay first click on this ayan guide where in how sharing you in your respective groups regarding this uh, document and go for ninth page and 10th page regarding ayan uh, uh, to install sab software so for this round sab tool is required for first round msb for this round sab for third round msb sab both required so don't delete those uh, uh, browser apps you keep waiting that okay sab tool please download okay where we have to download is this one click here to download you got already mail or else anyhow i'll share you the links directly to download the uh, respective sab tools okay and in mail you need this credential so this is login credentials you need to note down so you go to the mail id uh, mail you already got login credentials like super set id you people know password assessment pass key you have to know right so once you know these details you enter these are required okay while uh, attempting the exam it will ask you the details right and yeah these are the sab tools with respect to the windows no very important is it is not allowing app uh, apple or uh, okay macbook is not allowed apple devices are not allowed for this round it's not allowed keep in mind only windows is going to work right next how to start the test okay before that very important section you have to uninstall all this in your uh, system so microsoft edge skype team your whatsapp installed telegram installed because if you got any pop up exam will be closed you are requested to uninstall all this antivirus software many other okay like uh, iperius software a lot of other software also iperius get scanner a lot of get screen sorry lot of other software also you people try to uninstall away especially antivirus software type of thing bluetooth maintain off default try to use the browser as a google chrome sufficient light on face is badly required very good internet is badly required because of gaming if it is only quant round for 30 questions 30 minutes fine but gaming also there for that good internet is required so sufficient light so that's why we are requesting you people to sit opposed to the light and have a background must be plain clear and clean wall background must be clear and a clean wall right no images no photos nothing like that and if you want to check whether your system is working properly or not you can click on this link ss.cocubes.com it will show okay, if all these are tick mark means your system is working properly if right now here cab i am turned off okay you can Uh, turn on and uh, audio. It's used. We are fine detecting audio. Fine, it's all good, right? So I'll just close as it is done. All green tick marks. I can close it, right? So means my system is perfect for exam. That's system check. In fact, there is one more place where you can check your system as well. Next thing, how to start an exam? So you have to download that SAB tool. This is a zip file. You need to extract. This is a zip file. what are the version zip file you need to extract from that then install extract then install it once you install okay it will ask you certain details to fill yeah it is like this so access token you need to install here also if all are green tick then fine your system is working properly but mic and uh, camera i yeah, have already checked in the above link i suggest to people to go ahead with this link and then you install this sab there is no errors means fine you are good to go for the exam right then okay here university roll number date of birth not required it class ki super set id okay it's not this details so wait i'll just remove this
one more vector. Once you enter the access token, it will ask for your pass key, your superset ID, and password. Okay, which you people already noted down, so you can enter those. Then there is okay, start exam like that. We have a button to start the exam. So if it is uh, your window, let us say your exam is at 3 p.m., you can start the exam before 3:30 p.m. Generally, it's not 3 p.m. Okay, this exam is at 2 o'clock, 4 o'clock, 6 o'clock, 12 o'clock slot. So I'll go in that fashion only. So generally 12 noon slot, 12 p.m. slot, 2 p.m. and 4 p.m. and 6 p.m. are the general slots. <coughs> Might be some other slot also, don't worry. Let's see, okay, it's about 8 p.m. somehow like, okay. So if it is, uh, let us assume if your slot is at 2 p.m., you have to start the exam before 2.30 p.m. So 30 minutes login window login window is 13 30 minutes so if you don't start the exam in this time okay again nobody can help you you cannot start the exam if any exam missed you are not cleared for the interview you're not allowed for interview if you not attempted anything overall average overall score will be considered in all the three rounds of test then they'll check for the interview but if you not started exam any of the exam even though you got next round mail interview mail will not receive right and at any point of time, okay, once you log in, install this and you start somewhere, you just try to restart the system and uh, uh, make sure things will start on time. And B alert, it's a probe ring. Your eyeballs will be tracked. Up and down is allowed. Left and right, not allowed. When you are moving up and down, fine. You people are working on it, fine, allowed. Right and left, not allowed. Calculator, don't show it to the cameras. Quant is available. Uh, you just try to use calculator, but don't show to the camera. Pen and paper also don't show it to the camera. Pen and paper and uh, camera, make sure. Okay, if any mobile you are using for any purpose, don't uh, make sure it's not visible to the camera. Calculator or mobile, whatever you are using, make sure it is not visible to camera. For any reason you are using any of this, don't show to camera. Right, so mobile not visible to camera, that's what we mentioned. So here pen and paper not visible to camera. Camera put in a proper position. And as mentioned previously, try to avoid any noise in and around, like round one. Now, once we enter, it'll ask you write this. Okay, accept, do not accept webcam. Okay, your uh, uh, camera and microphone will be required. When you have to click on start now, it will start the test. As mentioned earlier, login windows is available. So you join into the login windows accordingly. So you have a slot for 2 to 4, 2.30. So you, you have to start to before 2.30, else nothing can be done. Again, webcam. So have a proper lighting on face. Okay, don't sit. Uh, this is what, no lighting here. No lighting. So no proper sitting here. You need to make sure you sit in a proper way not properly set, so not proper position. So you sit into the middle of the camera, so make sure things will be right. Enable full screen while starting the test, right? So don't move left or right, okay? Don't put empty, don't block the camera. Don't um, uh, use a third person. Third person should not be there while taking the exam. So proper lighting should be there on face. All this make sure, don't use the mobile or gadgets or notebook, anything during the exam. And see, let's say round one is quant. Round one is quant. Okay, you completed 30 questions. In 30 minutes or 20 minutes, whatever it may be, it's completed, fine. Then you will get uh, next round mail like this. It's not this one, okay, this is like, a, okay, you have to go for next exam. It's like completed. Congratulations, you completed this. Yeah, it's assessment process. Quant process is completed, assessment process completed. Next step is like it will now go for behavioral or uh, QT shapes, like they will get cut T shape, something like that. You'll get a message. You have to click on proceed to next step. Then once you go again, it will ask for camera, mic checking, everything. Then after that, very, very, very important point for gaming. Everybody make sure this point regarding gaming. Two steps where people will fail. 
this is important okay inform to your friends if anyone missed the things also in gaming once you enter it ask three check box to fill right there is some check box like i agree i agree like that this is you have to put tick mark we have to put to tick mark this one don't put tick mark among three check boxes only here i agree i agree something will come here matter here i agree i agree but this one i refuse will be there don't click on that i refuse only these three you have to take care right next what is the problem no if you suppose click on this third one you will get sign in id so how can you know i clicked on third one if some students some of your friends who got sign in id it is asking in gaming round sign in id means that person clicked on all three so again you need to close the exam and again you need to start okay so if this is the case close exam and start close in the sense you have to do power shutdown then we have to start power shutdown we have to do then we have to start the exam right okay and do's and don'ts okay make sure your laptop is charged okay full so that it will be avoided any power issues as well and have a background power power power, power plex internet okay maybe if internet is not there at least mobile apps for something like this mouse is badly required for gaming for a mouse is required for gaming so have a wide mouse not bluetooth mouse better to have a wide mouse then gaming can be done properly and yeah a quant anyhow if people can use some uh, we can say chat gpt or some other ai tools you can do it few questions it is showing wrong but i think you can clear the exam if you use gently chat gpt but again when you take the picture type the question is a different thing okay taking the picture simple questions you try difficult questions you just try to use chat gpt okay fine so under don't so don't show your share your pass key with anyone don't navigate from the main screen don't move away from the frame that's what don't try to cover your camera or unplug the external camera something so you just make sure things you have to log in using a single device don't log in from multiple devices it will close your exam so make sure you use same thing properly right so all the best i hope i covered few, few certain things and you can see i'm sharing you that uh, ion guide guidelines as well you can see if any other is there you can go ahead cognizant online assessment guidebook is there how to install the software everything if any issues come how to go at google chrome updated version you make sure right and you download the sab tools and if any errors how to overcome that is already given in this pdf you just have a look if you got all tick marks then done you are done with the job and make sure uninstall that antivirus because that sab will be corrupted if antivirus is there already so you take care of things this file i you know i'm sharing you can just check it out with that and at the time of submission if you don't have proper internet at the time of submission you will get lot of errors like this your results will be not posted and you cannot move to the next one so make sure you have a proper internet otherwise after round one you will get like this initially unable to load paper because internet is not there and at the submission here yeah, if your camera proper lighting on face is equal otherwise this pop up will come more times then it may leads to disqualification right and the next one at the end of first round here yeah, this is what we have to sit properly like this this all are not allowed right and after first round the result should be clearly updated means you need a good internet at the submission if you don't have good internet i'll show you the issues while like this will come for a minute yeah it will show your answer sheet is there this one we have to mail to them there are a lot of issues will come if you don't have proper internet at the time of submission even they mention you mail to the coordinator or something it's not possible this is all errors because at the time of submission you don't get the proper internet at the time of submission so make sure you have a proper uh, internet at the time of submission as well or entire exam for one hour at least have a good internet right all the best